pray that their words their testimonies will be words of hope that someone needs to hear today. I ask that you help them in their journey to living in your image. Amen.
diaries, digging an even bigger hole. The summer of 2017 was life changing for me. I was able to go to Chicago with my fellow church mates. I wasn't expecting, I wasn't expecting much out of it except exploring a different part of the world that I was from. Chicago showed me the beauty of God and how He works. I got to meet with some amazing people and make some new friends. My service that I was doing there was going to a KOK camp. I got to meet the kids and counselors that were so generous and sweet to us. I got to meet so many different people that would normally don't get to meet, see or meet in the small town of Dawson. I, the truth truly did help me to show how God works through other people and it began to, to be a turning point of how I look at God. A year, last year I joined the God Peace and again I wasn't expecting to expecting much out of it and I wasn't even planning to not go on tour. I mainly joined because my family wanted me to, but I also had this gut feeling that I should join. The gut feeling turned out to be the greatest decision in my life. I got to meet new people because of my friends that had joined. Not, not only was I able to grow closer with my friends, but with God. The God piece totally changed the way I think of my faith and the way God works in my everyday life. I got to travel with my friends. One of my favorite memories, moments out of the tour, was one of the places we had our services. Our services was going to be at Sister Bay. When we got to the destination, I was shocked because the service, because the service was taking place right at the beach. The scene was breathtaking from the moment I knew that this was going to be a service I wouldn't forget. Um, I knew that I would never forget this place because there is where I had my first battle moment. We were singing like, my, let my life song sing to you, and I felt something that was more than chill. It felt so powerful and so overwhelming, all I did was cry. I felt so connected to the song and the people around me, the environment, and to God. On tour, people talked about having their first God moments and being able to experience Him in their own special ways. I told myself that, probably, that this probably wouldn't happen to me because it felt weird to talk about. I, I was still very confused on the whole idea of a God moment. Like what, it, like, what does it feel like? All these questions that don't really explain because it's your own special moment with God that you're willing to take away from you. I'm very thankful for it. I'm very thankful for everything and everyone that has come into my life. I'm thankful for my family, my friends, my town, my community, and the opportunities I, I, I got to have. I'm very blessed to have the life I have. My faith has grown tremendously over the years. Never went to church anymore. We were always 
residency school because I started to find it boring. There were no fun question songs to sing anymore, no goofy stories we got to read, instead of worksheets and passages. I felt lost, no compass to guide me in my faith. For years I started struggling like a fish out of water. My heart and mind slowly clouded away from what I just love completely. I, <laughs> I started to walk down the dark path. Thank you. 